2014-199 State of Arkansas versus Ryan Lindsay. Mr. Lindsay, I see you've made an application to the Public Defender's Office. You say you're self-employed. Do you? What kind of income do you have? No. no. None. Okay. What does it mean to be self-employed? I guess looking for income again. Mr. Cooper, your client's going to have to speak up so that I can. Hear you. Ron, you need to speak up. Uh, I don't know, sir. I mean, I'm are, looking are for you, a job. Are you unemployed? Is that what you're saying? Yes, sir. You can go ahead and say that. Court will make the appointment of the public defender's office in this case. Mr. Lindsay's for arraignment on charges of residential burglary, Class B felony, and theft of property, Class D felony. Your Honor, on both charges, we would enter a plea of not guilty and waive formal reading of the charges. Your Honor, there are no other issues to be taken up today. There's a parole issue, so there's no bond issues to be taken up. Okay. The court is... Uh, The court will set, it for, set the case for appearance in front of uh, Judge Putman on August 21st. You may be excused. 2014-196, State of Arkansas versus Cody Egloff. Egloff for arraignment on charges of uh, fleeing a Class D felony in violation of protective order. Separate Class D felony. On the charges, how does he plead? Not guilty, Your Honor. Waive formal reading of the charges. The court is noting the plea of not guilty. We'll set the matter by scheduling order. The, uh, we're scheduling at this time uh, jury trial for uh, February 17th. Uh, Pre-trial hearings will, uh, of that's of 2015, obviously. Set a pre-trial for December 11th, 2014, and a status reappearance for November 20. Those orders, those dates will be included in the written scheduling order. Any other matters to be taken up at this time? No, Your Honor. All right. Then it may be excused. 2014-197, State of Arkansas versus Michael Pierce. Mr. Pierce is for arraignment on charges of residential burglary. Class B felony and theft of property, Class A misdemeanor. Your Honor, we've been in a plea of not guilty uh, on behalf uh, to all charges. On, on behalf of Mr. Pierce, we have formal reading of the charges. That plea is noted. The court is setting this for a reappearance in front of Judge Putman on uh, August 21st. Any other matters to be taken up? This Your Honor, there's no bond issues in this. I understand that uh, he's already signed. Uh, a waiver on a parole uh, situation. Very well. You may be excused, sir. 2014 yeah. 195, State of Arkansas versus yeah. Christy Newcomer. Ms. Newcomer is for arraignment on a charge of um, forgery in the second degree, a Class C felony. Your Honor, uh, she is a Today, appointee, I believe, to our office, we're in a plea of not guilty. Way formal reading of the charges. Court will note the plea. Set the matter for reappearance in front of Judge Putman on uh, August 21st. Any other matters to come before the court? Your Honor, thank you, Mr. 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 She has a revocation pending, Your Honor, that will be served on her if it hasn't been already. It's already been served, yes. Yeah. Is it toward this because of this though? Uh, this one. Oh, uh, several things, ma'am. Okay. It's in the what in what you're served has it in there. Your Honor, I understand because of the probation violation that has now been served that Mr. Nucio is recommending no bond. Uh, therefore, there's no bond issues to take up right. today. All right. You 
may be excused.